Hi there, this is Biden again. And now that Biden guy is going to tell us his tale, and I'm getting quite dry mouthed here again. I would be happy to hear that story, so go ahead, my friend. It's not a happy story, sir, but I shall tell thee all the same. Sir Roderick was once a member of our order, but abandoned the principles of our order and now calls himself the Chaos Knight. Oh, isn't that a little cheesy? Alright. Terrorizing the entire northern area. Since to attack one with many would be dishonorable, our leader Donor picked me to defeat him in single combat. When I reached the old banquet hall to the north, I was suddenly attacked by Roderick, who leaped from a ledge above me and took me off guard. He attacked relentlessly, and although I hit him several times, my own blows did little to slow him or curb his ang apparent anger. He taunted me continuously as we fought, and I would not listen as I attempted to and would not listen as I attempted to reason with him. Well, I'm surprised they are still alive. After several minutes I was bleeding from several runes and thinking my time was up. In desperation I flung my sword at him. He blocked it easily, but the distraction allowed me to run from him. So that is my story. I cannot return to my, ho to my home until I have eliminated Roderick and restored our order's honor, but, I will be, but it will be some time now before I am capable of fighting. So I wait here, far from the trolls and other pests, gathering my strands before I head off again. They are going to attack him again. I'd give the rest of my right arm for a chance to take the, the rogue on again. He'd find out what sort of knight I am. Perhaps I can defeat him. That would be quite honorable of thee. If thou dost meet a rogue and defeat him, it would not only bring great honor to thee, but also perhaps save my life. So I'm going to seek him out. The Chaos Knight. A man who names himself the Chaos Knight. Like he sprang from a comic book. From the Brotherhood of Evil. Oh well. Oh come on. Thank you. So, I don't know. I think that Chaos Knight should be difficult, but just in case we're going to save here. Is that hostile? No, it's mellow. So there he is, but we're going to go come from another direction. Well, take a quick walk down here. Oh, a spider. Well, that probably is hostile. Are you hostile? Well, now she's dead. Okay. Let's take a look at that knight. Hi there. Are you a knight? Yes, Roderick. How another has come to be defeated by the Chaos Knight. Very well, let us see how quickly I can slay thee. Man, I'm the Avatar, you won't slay me. Mm -hmm. He's not doing much damage, but I'm not doing either. Oh well. Let's pack him into a corner. Green. Ah. Now we're talking. Mm -hmm. Well, I think we're winning here. And he's dead. Nice. So what do we have here? A key. Key is always nice. Let's take it. And a sword. A serviceable jeweled sword. Of additional damage. Nice. So I know that a broad sword is better than a long sword. But I don't know whether a broad sword is better than a magical long sword of additional damage. So we're going to drop that. And drop that as well, and take that. Well... Okay. And we found a few coins as well. 37, actually. Wow, that's quite a lot. So let's open that door here. Oh yeah, there was a secret door. Just in case you didn't notice. 
massive tool as well. We opened it. And the little rat. The rat is dead. So we're going to explore the stuff here. Oh there's see there's a secret door. Open it. Kill the rat. No. Try to hit the rat. Thank you. What do we have here? A potion. What does it do? Alright. Restored a little bit of health. I didn't do anything. There's another secret room, see? And here's a little bit of gold hidden. Oh, come on. See? Gold chain. Don't need that. Another red. Twenty two coins, Tw twenty three coins, and that is the door of precious levers. You know, a silver switch and a gold switch. So now we're going to try to open that here. And it's open. And what do we have here? A ragged scroll. Sir Ingvar. Here lies Sir Ingvar, Knight of the Order of the Cruise on Santa. I know. Oh no, I can't pick that up. Well, probably now I can. Damn, that's heavy. Another secret wall somewhere here. Secret door. Probably not. Let's take a look at the map. Yes, that's all. Three secret drawers in here. So now we're going this way. Is this the right way? Yes. I think we're going to drop I don't know how many gold how much gold do we have Twi oh take a look at that let's drop 70 coins here okay and now we open that door as well what's the time uh-huh Oh, I don't want to go there now. So here, what do we have here? We have the Great Stair. Oh, there's no, nothing actually here. Just some, you know, curious floor. And that is the Bullfrog Puzzle. With those thingies, you can raise the ground in the middle of the room, and in that way, you can create um, some sort of stair. But I never had the patience for that puzzle. You have to jump up here. If you create those stairs, you can jump up there. But, hmm, you know. Since you can actually fly using magic, there's no need to do that. We're just mapping out the ma mapping out this area here, so we get a good look at it. 
so and if you take a look on the map you see here actually is some sort of illusionary wall or something like that so let's take a good look here okay let's use the spell let's save and that's it we're going to take a quick break here and we'll see each other in the next video so bye thanks for watching